Hello everyone, it's Kat here from Evil Krispy Kreme again to show you some more Final Fantasy XIV. As you can see here, I actually have an Arcanus now, mainly because I fell in love with the little pink hairdo and I decided to re-roll. But anyway, that's not what we're here for, besides maybe looking at our cute little bear. Mm, cutie. Anyway, what I want to do with this video is show you what, how easy it is to swap between jobs. So, uh, we get to start picking new jobs once you get level 10. You have to do your level 10 qu class quest first. Which means that you do need to be actually level 10 to get the quest. Uh, it, the quests are very easy. I've done it for a few classes now and I haven't had any problems whatsoever. Okay, so I decided to pick up fishing. I thought that was pretty harmless and we'll see what it's like compared to other fishing classes and MMOs. So I actually have gear sets. Uh, these that come through your character sheet. They open up and you can save multiple ones as you can see up to nine. I simply click equip and my little pet is gone. So now I'm a fisher person instead of a carcanus. You might notice that my one and two bar has changed but my seven has stayed the same which is kind of good because this is the cute little pre-order pet. I have actually do have a collector's edition but it doesn't seem to let me enter my key yet so I'm actually still playing on my pre-order key. So and oh actually I will just quickly show you this is the pre-order hat. <laughs> I know pretty adorable. Anyway so now I'm a fisher person. Uh, you can it's simple, even though you've saved it, it's as simple as just pretty much now I'm an Arcanus. Now I'm a Fisher person. Arcanus. Fisher person. You might notice my gear wasn't changing at all. That's because I haven't, I wasn't using set ones. Uh, but even though I was a fishing person, if I, I couldn't wear my Arcanus gear because it's too high a level. So anyway, now we're a Fisher person we have a fishing rod. If you notice we've got four skills down the bottom and they're fairly easy to use. So we'll just head to some water, you know when you're close because the number two goes from being sort of dull to up. Okay, so first we've got to pick our bait. I've got three separate types of bait here we can use. So we'll use the crayfish balls. We then cast our rod and now we have to wait for a bite. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Ah, oh, I didn't have any bites. Ah, oh, apparently the bait I'm using is wrong. This is what I get for never using that bait before. So we can reel in by pressing number four. And we can go back to our bait. And we know these ones work because we were using these ones before. I must admit, I'm not quite sure where those crayfish balls came from. So now we wait for a nibble. Wait. Wait for it. There we go. And we press number three to wheel it in. And hello, we've caught something. Yay, so we've caught something new. Excellent. So, we've caught ocean clouds. Hmm. We'll just try again. Now did you watch the end of the pole, the way it moves as if, well I guess like real fishing, when you get quite a big strike I must admit. You don't have to do any sort of reeling, you just reel her in once you've done it. Oh wow, didn't <laughs> say anything. How cool is that? So anyway, we can go down here to our personal logs and go to fishing logs. And as you can see, we've got, oh, it looks like, oh, we're missing one. So this question mark here means we're missing one fish. Uh, if you notice, we've got lots of different areas to fish in, but obviously we're in the city at the moment, on the lower darks. 
So it's kind of like a halfway between achievement base, you know, trying to catch all the fishies. Um, <laughs> she will stand like that for ages too. All you gotta do is move and she puts it away and now you're unlocked again. And if you notice here, this is where our fishies are kept as well as our bait. This is where everything goes, it's your bags. You do have four of these tabs. And no grey items, you might notice. Everything is usable by something. Well, at least I'm assuming it is. Um, I'm actually forgot to update my top. So we might just go into the armory chest. Uh, ah, here we go. So this is the top we got from the level 5 quest. Um, definitely flattering. Really, I'm sure it is. So now we go into our gears list. Hmm, I wonder if we can save it. Oh look at that. Wow, we can do all these things. <laughs> anyway, so that is fishing. Uh, as you might notice, like when you're actually a fisher, it, it says that I'm a level 6 fisher, which means that's my actual class. I am a level 6 fisher. It's not a little mini thing you can do on this side. It's not... It's not just something to make you waste time. You can actually level as a fisher person and I think that's pretty cool it, it's not hard it's fun um, but then again I do enjoy fishing in other games and I just think it's adorable so for now I'll say goodbye thanks again for watching this is Kat from Evil Krispy Kreme and enjoy your gaming time bye <laughs>